Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is really exciting because I will be trying out this eyeshadow palette which is by Manish Malhotra and this is a collaboration with My Glam. If you guys are living under a rock and you guys don't know about this collaboration, My Glam recently collaborated with Manish Malhotra and they came out with a couture makeup collection. So they have a couple of lip products and a couple of eyeshadow palettes too. I was so excited when I heard about this collaboration because India is a little behind in collaborations and stuff. But it is so good to see makeup brands collaborating with designers and bloggers. My Glam also collaborated with Anam Chashmawala who is an amazing blogger. I already cannot wait to get my hands on those products too. I have never tried any products from My Glam so this is my first time trying this brand out too. So My Glam is available on Amazon. You can get this from Amazon and the shipping was also very fast. I got it within 2 days which is pretty good. So this costed me 1850 rupees which is slightly on the pricier side but when i saw the packaging i definitely feel it's worth it and coming on to the product this is the box in which the palette came in it comes with this really nice case which has sponge in it to, of course to protect the palette and this is how the palette looks like it looks super bougie and expensive it looks like a high end palette and i honestly expected this palette to be a little more bigger because it has nine shadows inside it this literally looks like a quad with four eye shadows but it has nine eye shadows i love how simple and sleek the packaging is it just has manish malhotra and my glam written on it and also i love all the rose gold details looks really pretty and expensive so let's open the palette so when you open the palette there's this Firstly there is this plastic case to cover it and this is how the palette looks like it has a really nice mirror which i really appreciate so these are really tiny pans like these are smaller than the regular eye shadow pans i want to show you guys a comparison also but i love the color selection the, the color selection is something i absolutely love i can instantly think of 10 different eye looks just by looking at this palette you can create neutral looks as well as really dramatic smoky eye looks so it says that it has metallics mattes sparkles and pearl eye shadows so these are all the finishes you get in this small palette and i actually like the size of this palette it literally fits in my palm you can easily throw this in your purse or you can easily travel around with it i haven't touched or swatched any of these colors so i will just show you guys a couple of swatches of different different finishes first i will be swatching any matte color oh they feel really soft and buttery and it's pretty pigmented the mattes are very very pigmented they're really soft and buttery too i'm really excited to try this gold color and this is so beautiful and reflective you can see i have some left on my finger as well next i will be swatching this purple shadow oh even this is pretty pigmented So I guess this is one of the pearl finish. So these are the finger swatches of all the shadows from the top row up till the bottom row. I think quality wise these shadows are really great but what matters at the end is the performance on the eye I absolutely cannot wait to put this on my eyes so without any further ado let's get started with the video so I don't know if these eye shadows will have fallout or not so before starting with my eye makeup on I will just pack on some loose powder under my eye and then do my makeup so that I don't ruin my foundation or concealer So I've got you guys a little closer so that you can actually see what I'm doing on my eyes. So first, so first I'm taking this chocolate brown eye shadow and applying this as a transition. The brush has picked up a lot of product, so I'll just dust the excess and start blending it in like this.
right off the bat i can see that the mats are really really pigmented you definitely need a lighter hand when you're using these eye shadows next i'm taking this gray color on a smaller precise blending brush so there's definitely a lot of pickup i'm just going to place this color first i'm taking a blending brush and just softly blending it on the same blending brush i'm taking that chocolate brown color again and just buffing all the edges there is a little bit of patchiness on this eye i don't know if you guys can see it but i can see it there's just a tiny tiny bit of patchiness So now I have these two colors blended on my eyes pretty well and for my lid color I will be taking this light bronzy gold color and I will be first trying it out with a shader brush if it doesn't work very well I will be going in with my fingers so I'm just stamping this on my eyelid Okay so shimmer shadows usually works best with your fingers but surprisingly this shadow works very well with this brush too i can see a lot of pigment on my eyes i have to say this that i love the shimmer eye shadow i think it looks so beautiful and you can get a very precise application with a brush i'll also go in with my finger and just see if i can build the shine and yes it looks pretty intense now so i'm trying to use as many colors as i can just to test it out so i'm also taking this yellow golden color and just applying it on top of the uh on top of the shimmer eye shadow with this one i really think i have to use my finger So now I will be dusting all the loose powder with a fluffy brush. For my lower lash line, I'm taking this brown eye shadow again. Next, I'm going in with this black eye shadow. and it it has some specks of glitter in it a really really tiny micro glitters so this is definitely not a matte black eye shadow and i'm just smoking out the lower lash line I really wish there was a lighter color for the inner corner and brow bone highlight but since there isn't any I will be using another palette So for mascara I'm using the Maybelline Colossal Volume Express mascara and this is the waterproof one done with my eye makeup so i will just finish the rest of my makeup and be right back so this is the final makeup look i absolutely love how the eyes turned out especially that gold shadow on my entire lid this one right here i absolutely love this finish it looks so gorgeous and also the other shimmer eye shadows are really pigmented and very very nice however the matte ones were a little bit patchy Uh I don't know if you guys can see but I did make it work it's not something you absolutely cannot work with but the shimmer eye shadows are worth every penny I absolutely love them the only disappointing thing is the size of the palette 
I mean, I like that it is travel size, but it should be marketed as travel size palette. And I completely forgot to compare this with my other palettes. So, so this is my NYX eyeshadow palette. It has 16 shadows and compared to this, it looks fine because this has 9 shadows and this has 16. But when you actually compare the pan size of each eyeshadow, so this is the difference side by side. They are definitely more smaller and it overall looks like a, a travel size eyeshadow palette. So I wish they marketed this as a, as, as a travel size eyeshadow palette. So this is exactly the size of this Nika blush. I mean, I like that it is compact size and you can just throw this in your bag. But I'm also kind of disappointed because I expected this to be somewhat of this size and it turned out to be like a compact size. If you are into this travel size kind of eyeshadows, also they have a neutral one also. So if you want to invest in that one neutral eyeshadow palette, I would highly recommend you guys to go and purchase that one. I completely forgot to tell you guys the shade name of this palette and it is Rendezvous. I guess I'm pronouncing that right but I will uh, write it somewhere on the screen. So overall I feel that the performance of the eyeshadow was really great. Especially the metallics and the shimmers, they are fabulous. And also the color selection, the packaging, everything is on point. For a first impressions, I absolutely love this eyeshadow palette. And I think My Glam has done a fabulous job by collaborating with Manish Malhotra. And they have come out with this amazing collection. So this is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!